Speaking of the holidays, it is always a dilemma the day after Thanksgiving. What do you do with all the leftovers? Well, we're joined now by Sri Dival from Mama's Comfort Food and Cocktails in Orange County with some tips on some easy things to it make. How to so utilize those good. leftovers. It smells amazing. We, we may it. have already had a plate. <laughs> or two. It's good. It's perfect. <laughs> a plate or two to start the day is perfect. So I love starting with dessert because why not? Why not? <laughs> Let's just get right into it. The holidays are all about. So what have you done absolutely. here? It's like a pumpkin so pie parfait. This is so fun. So this is a pumpkin pie parfait. Oh. So we you know if you were entertaining so or you smart. have a house full of guests like you have to remake food to make mm. it delicious and they don't want to eat a Thanksgiving meal again and again so we kind of do it a little bit different so this is a pumpkin pie so we actually just scrape the goodness out of the pumpkin pie really? Greek yogurt and then cinnamon oh, graham really crackers. Smart. This is not my first pumpkin pie of the day. <laughs> Maybe not true? your last, just depending. <laughs> um, that's a fantastic idea. And I yeah. love that you put it mm. in the glass, like the different glasses. Totally. It makes it very festive again. Totally. And it's just a stemless wine glass. Most everyone has that. You can do it in a stemmed wine glass. It's just really easy. Kind of utilize what you have at the house. Okay, I smell rosemary yes. and yes. herbs. So, so what's going on? Okay, so that would either be the chicken and biscuits, ah. which we know. Well, it's actually turkey gravy and biscuits with okay. bacon, of course. Mama's always does bacon. These are our I may have had some bacon this morning. <laughs> We sent a little your way. Um, so these are our buttermilk biscuits. So these are really easy. If you have extra biscuits or you still have them in the can or you're making them yourself, chances are you have leftovers. So make the biscuits, add some rosemary, add some bacon bits, and then of course, turkey gravy, which is amazing. So just fold all that extra shredded turkey in. It's a beautiful breakfast to welcome your guests when they yeah. wake up in the morning. It looks beautiful. It smells beautiful. Potatoes too, right? Oh yes. You can't go wrong with homestyle oh, potatoes. Amazing. I see gravy down there. That's so good. Okay, so this is mama's take on a poutine. So traditionally Ooh. a classic of um, Canada, so this is a real Canadian classic food, but we did it a little bit different. So shredded turkey on top, we actually used Velveeta, so Ooh, traditionally it's cheese curds and gravy. So we did Velveeta and then of course you have your leftover turkey gravy. We did it on tots instead of fries because who doesn't love yeah, tots, no right? Kidding. <laughs> well and they're so easy, you can just throw them in the air fryer exactly. and then use them. Mm -hmm. So easy. So we're trying to make it really easy just to utilize that and not to eat Thanksgiving dinner again and again. So yeah. kind of these are creative. so creative all these ideas that's what I think you know normally you just think of like a sandwich right yes. like you just <laughs> yeah. like throw two pieces of bread uh -huh. and some turkey on but you've done not at mom no, no you have a whole <laughs> twist here okay so this is really easy to do at home as well so this is an herbed goat cheese you just pick that up at Trader Joe's really anywhere and then this is just a seasoned um, bell pepper which ironically they have jars everywhere now grocery stores mm -hmm. super easy and then artichoke hearts so it's a little bit of a Mediterranean flair Yum. and then of course your leftover turkey breast that's already seasoned and Flavor. Yeah, different profile from the Thanksgiving dinner last yes, night, which is totally. awesome. So, okay, you, we only did you use this in the pot pie? We did. Just, okay, so, so turkey, carrots, yes. or rosemary. Anything you have left over. Sweet potato, carrot, celery, if you have mirepoix, from stuffing. Throw that in with a can of cream of chicken. So easy. And so you just mix that all up. And then um, I just grab a can of biscuits when I do it at home. And you just lay it out and then you make that beautiful kind That's of That's so top. smart. It's beautiful. really easy. Okay, okay we have one cook. minute left. What are, okay, what are we let's doing? Okay, let's try it. So well, let's try it. Okay, so what we're going to do here is we have the egg mixture. We're going to make a turkey fried steak. So Ooh. this is for breakfast. So And then so if you want to try it or I could do it, whichever. Yep. But okay, grab Rube, it. Rube, you go ahead. going to end well. Oh, you, you know what? You've got to do the egg batter oh, yep. first. <laughs> See, and then, and then the flour? Yeah, and okay. then you okay. dredge it in flour. Okay, so okay. your turkey is already I cooked. I feel like I'm on one of these chef shows. Yeah, do it right? yes. quickly. You, you have 30 seconds yes. to make the Will perfect turkey breast. You're going to do it. Is that good? I have faith in you. Kind of dust off the flour just so it doesn't pop back at you. Yeah, because it's Perfect. It's going to splatter. I'm just be careful. Just scared. Real slow, real slow. Perfect. Yep, yep. yep. There we go. You got it. You did great. <laughs> Yay. Yay. But that's so smart because you don't want to just keep eating the turkey no. breast over and yes. over and over and over and over. So it makes this beautiful dish. You add it with country gravy, potatoes, of course, two sunny sides eggs. You're good to go. So you've really recreated your leftovers. Do I flip Maybe this now? Yes. <laughs> So your turkey's already cooked, so you just be careful it might splatter. I'm scared. Can Here. I do it for you? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Let, let the professional take over. I'm like, I don't, it's okay if I get splattered, but I don't want you to get splattered. No. So do that well, we don't here. want you splattered What a either. beautiful that looks work great. of art I made. So the turkey's already cooked, so you just want to crisp this up and you're good to go. And then you have a beautiful uh, turkey fight steak. These are amazing ideas. Thank I, you so much. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Uh, thank, yes. Thank, uh, thank you. And I'm, I'm going to take this and this. <laughs> I'll be back later. Um, Paul, I don't know about you. What, what can I bring you? Because you know we have so much. I'll take five minutes for weather so you have time to enjoy the Thank meal. Thank you.